Hey guys, hope everybody's doing well today. Um, I kind of want to grind this out just to get the finale done of uh, Scribble Nuts Unlimited. If you're live and you know it, clap your hands. <coughs> ah, crap, I mistimed that. And I just realized I completely uh, forgot to uh, throw my avatar. Give me a second here. It's been a day. A little bit tiring day, but yeah, whatever. I'm unicorns, welcome unicorns. <laughs> uh, where's my... There we go, should be all good now. Hope everyone's having a good rest of their day. Or a good, good day so far, I mean. And I'm so out of sorts. Anyways, let's get right into this. The faster we start, the faster we can get this done, the faster we can start some new games. Ampersand Beach. There we go. Alrighty. Let's start off with one side. That is the one side. I need a beach body to impress the ladies. Alright, what do we do to help them? Are you winning fire? I don't know yet. I wanna help. I wanna I wanna try to see if we can finish this off. Of course I'm gonna need Chet to really help out on this one. Oh greatly apologize, holy crap. Give him steroids. I uh, can't give drugs. Sad. Uh, I don't know if we can give the uh, objective sad, but we'll we'll see. That didn't work. I, I assume buff magic is a thing in this reality. We can try. I'm guessing let's just turn to the pill. Unfortunately, buff is a word. What about like healthy food or like workout equipment? Let's see if I can do... Mm. Damn, he got swole. Popeye spinach. <laughs> Help us make up a new game. Give us something to throw over the net. That isn't a ball. All right, we need to throw something over the net that isn't a ball. Ch 
child. Nope. What if it's small child? This game is excellent. I need something to build a sandcastle with. Or do we what do we use to build a sandcastle? I don't want to say bucket because that's not funny. I mean, you could always do something with the bucket. Do something ridiculous like a sand mixer or some or a cement mixer. Orange laser bucket. can't leave land without something to bring me luck on my adventure. Alright, we need something lucky. Radiated 40 leaf clover. Unfortunately, I can't do the number four, so I'll just do Clover. Also, somehow I completed a sec one, uh, waking up that thing. So that <laughs> radiated four leaf Clover just solved two problems at once. three more and then we can do the thing. Stand still. Give me something for a relaxing day at the beach. Alright, how's this man's relaxing? And how's it going, C4? Also, thanks for the hydrate and the posture check. Give me a second here. Self care, bitches. Yeah, that's for everybody. Let's 
excuse me. Flaming Sun Hat. It's going good and nice. Lurk as well. Alright, thanks for the Lurk C4. Hopefully your day is good. Go ahead, Ginger Island is very fun. That's on... Um... Oh, so sorry. That's on uh, Stardew, correct? Excuse me. Apparently Sun Hat's not a word. We're trying to, for those who just come in, we're just, uh, we're trying to get somebody to relax on the beach. You need something to relax on the beach with. Magic pills. <laughs> I don't think that works. Band letters F, C, and L. Okay. Thank you for capitalizing it. I'll just make sure it's different from the I. If I accidentally press them, that doesn't count. But this that's that's an, that's an incredible ban for everybody in this chat. Beer? Uh, can't do alcohols. Alcohol and drugs or any kind of profanity, sadly enough. Covered chair laser flames. <laughs> water. Alright. Wait. That is... Cool. Someone call qualified should go flying on the hang glider. Alright. Who, what kind of uh, air-based person should go? <laughs> Expert orphan. I think that fits. Should have banned more letters? I think three is a fair amount. <laughs> Brudge. I actually kind of want to... Give me a second. I wanna, while, while you guys think of something, go ahead and search better TTV. Because I do believe I have one more slot. I have added Brudge, <laughs> except it's a capital B. <laughs> it started and I thought, would you guys have any issues if I, I came in on this one? Wait, is this the... I had one, but I banned L. 
I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna try one. Damn it! I I thought I thought what better for expert of flying than than someone to fly himself. How much time do we have left on that band, by the way? Have I lost time? Dug your grave, now you must lie in it. Yeah. Skydiver. Ooh, that's a good one. There you go. This last one, then we'll work on the other thing. One minute or less? Alright. I need to get my satellite into orbit. Uh, Alright, now we're going to launch this thing into orbit. We are free. All right. Giant eating device. <laughs> Unfortunately, ye I know is not a word. Tiny blue. Oh, rockets. I promise you I there was a tiny blue one. All right, we need another contestant for our reality show. It's getting any all right. Welcome to Survival Island. Compete against the others to win a fantastic prize. Build a fire to make it to the next round. Alright, how are we lighting this bitch? I'm an easy but lurking. Alright, too good. Uh, thanks for the lurk, man. Flamethrower, burning orphan. Alright. I saw flamethrower first. Also welcome gumbo. <laughs> that was excessive. Nerd use magnifying glass. Just survivor. You have made so many people eat babies. A burning orphan is nothing. Yeah. Three contestants remain. Find a way to make the armadillo more visually appealing to the audiences at home. All right. How are we doing this? What adjectives are we giving? Actually, hold on a second. <laughs> Square game and scribble mods. Yeah, I know. Uh, so we're gonna say top hat. Alright, uh, we're gonna put this in the ground for now. And then we're gonna add handsome glittery. No, I didn't put the hat on right. Fuck. Let's scribble these nuts. Yeah. Ah. 
<laughs> we are down to the final two contestants. Create an object that is similar to both a pickle and wings. What is a pickle and wings? Okay, that dude got unlucky. He had the snake and not the turtle. Yeah. I don't know why, but I really enjoy baiting toxic people. Maybe that's why I like GTA Online so much. What'd you, what'd you do to bait? Green bird. Green bird. Can we get some hurines in chat? Pickled angel. <laughs> Just follow some nerd killing nerds and just enable passive mode. Yeah, I don't know why, but passive mode really upsets these people. Some people got butter for no stupid reason on GTA. It's it's really dumb. Like I saw somebody complaining about a modder, and the modder wasn't really doing anything except just flying around and just messing with cops. Like, it, it, they really didn't have oh. Sorry, I found way too much amusement in that. Alright, we're done the mainland. Now time to do these three and then the final mission. I think that's the final mission. I hope that's the final mission. 69? Nice. You know, I think the wizard won. The wizard was kind of fucked from the beginning. Because he got a lizard and wings. What is he supposed to do for that? I'll be making castle over in his day? Yeah. Or was this a storybook key? Alright, so that's... There's 12 in here, holy crap. My nose, it grows from all of my lies. If I promise I'm honest... Or if I promise I'm honest... Can you restore it in size? How the fuck am I supposed to... Oh. You can always find that one guy with 420 KD and glitched club outfit or some shit and they say is every... Oh yeah, yeah. Every time they get a kill. Yeah, it's stupid. Um... What are we doing? Chainsaw? I can't do it myself, I'm too afraid. Well, that actually worked. I'm a real boy! They're the type of people that say, if you don't want to get PvP enabled pass mode, and then get annoyed when you enable pass mode, yeah. Some people just don't know how to have proper etiquette online, it really bothers me. I once had a little lamb. I planned to have... Uh, oh, uh, there once was a little lamb I planned to have for lunch. Can you help me help me locate her? I've, I haven't got a hunch. Alright, so that's another search one. There's a lot here. 
That's a cat. Whatever. We'll, we, we'll find that lamb later. Fire, give that guy a poison sheep. Okay. But, bro, I don't want to be the tech literate guy in this household. Uh, what's what's going on there, bud? That's not my sheep. Okay. We'll get it later then. We'll, we'll find it eventually. Alright, I did see something... Here. The mirror says hot, I'm not. Wow, it that hurts a lot. Uh what adjective are we giving her? My mom doesn't know which charger is hers and we can't join a zoom meeting. Ugh. Why does he care what sheep is if he's gonna eat it? Some some people just are attached to the burgers that they raise. Oh, crap, Ola. I just popped my neck. There's a free posture check for you. She has an also, also has an old-ass laptop from 2012 running Windows 10. Oof. Sorry, I'm in a sheep rage. What are we doing? Uh, the mirrors told this one woman uh, that she's not hot. So I'm trying to think of an adjective. Target spotted some nerd with 9 KD and level 7. Oof. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't do it to him. Go on no. No, he's already dead. Hot? Okay. Glittery. <laughs> what the fuck? Spin to gold, spin to gold. I can spin anything new or old. Alright, what are we giving him to spin? Who <laughs> could a litter on fire yet? I'm gonna blow it up with that dumb RC car and then go past it to see how they react. <laughs> uh, I thought you had to be out of combat for a certain time in order to be a passive. Is this game is age rating? I have no idea. Don't know how to stay inside then. <laughs> Ah, uh, fuck. How do you call that shit? What do you mean? Give him chicken nuggets, okay? Alright, he just spun chicken nuggets into gold. Honestly, impressive. Oh, crap. Help me find my royal wife. Only she can feel. Small foods between the mat. Oh, it's 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 the princess and the pea. Hope you reveal. Whatever. What small food are we putting in between the sheets? Minus his booty does the same. Yep. Cla <laughs> clap that ass, get some gold. <laughs> so we need a small food. Small soup. Alright. Hmm. <laughs> All 
right, let's start off the far right here. I've huffed and I've puffed, but to my chagrin, I need some help blowing this piggy's house in. Alright, what are we using to blow down this? Fuck Mori, he's cringe, yeah. I did a pun which reminds me of Shiro who disappeared. Ah, oh, Shiro's still kicking about, he's just kind of more busy working right now. Dynamite, nice. L lube? What the fuck, fix? I think we need something that blows. Sonic Bomb. No, no, I don't think blow up, more like blow down, like with wind or something. Air fan? Didn't work. Sonic Bomb does, like, no damage. Kinetic weaponry is always fascinating. Nukes quite might a lot of wind. <laughs> Big lungs. I'm gonna try something out here. Yeah, you basically had to blow up the house. That's stupid. Alrighty. My love for her just leaves me sobbing. I wish we had more things in common. What is she? She's a maid, he's a giant. How are we... How are we making them more equal? Make her tall and handsome. She grew like a half inch and now they're together. Yay. These rats have got though these rats have gotten out of control. I need something that's musical. Musical, I guess. All right, what what instruments are we giving them? Midget Kazoo. Oh man, those those rats have gotten jazzy. How the fuck do I get in there?
How the hell do I get in? Okay, I'm in. Alright. Why are we sus? I have no idea. My hair loves to grow and grow and get stuck and stuff like this window. Alright, how, how are we trimming this hair? I can only do one or the other because they're both nouns. Unfortunately, that means you have to decide. I mean, if you, if you want, I can try, like, something stupid. Knife. Okay. Hot knife. Man, it's gonna smell terrible. Why is she wearing a giant hat? All the king's horses and all the king's men left and I've gone all to pieces again. Alright, how are we putting this boy back together? <laughs> okay, drama queen. Holy frog. You've been waiting to try to figure out where a holy frog would fit in, didn't you? Holy frog apparently didn't work. God? Well, we'll see. So, God picked up the frog, but didn't know what to do. I think we need more... Oh, yeah, glue. And he fell over again.
Oh, it's... Ha! Help me, buddy, help me. Meow, help me get these boots off now. Alright, how, how are we getting the boots off? Is it normal for GTA sweats to have sidekicks? There's some nerd with this guy that has a KD of 0.6. Maybe? Small slippery, okay. Yay, puss out of boots. <laughs> I'm missing two. Thanks for mutton. I still haven't found that one. Cradle and all. Rock a baby. Please make it stop and get me safely down before. Get me down safely before I fall off. Alright, we gotta find that. Help me down. Oh, guy's stuck in a tree, that's why. me down safely before I fall off. Uh, we need something to help him fall slowly. They're in the same club and organization. I assume it's just that they're there to dance for him and where he's like a little brother. Yeah. That being said, there could be a... Nope, there's no lamb in a tree. What the fuck is this lamb? Where's the lamb sauce? Honestly, if I was to ever meet Gordon Ramsay, I would give him a hug more than anything. Like, man, man's a... I, I, I really enjoy his content, and deep down, despite him, like, blasting people, I think he's a good person. Or at least he tries to be. Where the fuck is this lamb? Wow, this guy's upset they messaged me. You, you fucking idiot. 1v1 me right now. Ha! <laughs> oh my goodness, man. Uh, just, uh, say baby rage at him. Like. He's voting to kick me. What a, what a salt lord. Come on. Still haven't found the stupid lamb. I am Babby. Where's the McFucking Lamb? <laughs> Let's just try Lamb.
Really? As far as I know, he's nice to Master Chef kids. I think it's only pissed off people who don't try to improve. It's not. He has different standards for like home chefs compared to uh, like uh, people who are quote unquote prof professional. You know? Why does it look like an egg? I have no idea. I I I shouldn't do that one. Give me a second. Trying to think, what, what, what egg? <laughs> I want to fuck. I want to send a mugger after this guy, but he's hovering around me. And I can't leave passive. I, I didn't know. Uh, I guess that would make sense. What if we helped it like search for things, like, like gave him like searching equipment or something? God? Well, like, we can try God. Mm. Tracker? Okay. Oh my goodness, what am I witnessing? Has just tried to kill God and lost. Sweaty nerd. Okay. Ew. Why does the tracker hit God? I have no idea. All right. Let's let's. Any other searching things that we can do? That might work. Magnifying glass. Oh. Oh, he's having dinner with the sheep. Slightly more concerning. <laughs> Now we can do this one, finally. Help Hansel and Gretel survive this, uh, harrowing tale. Hansel and Gretel are out exploring. Give them something to leave a trail behind them. Alright, we need, we need to give something to do to make a trail with. And skid mark is not an option. Frog. Frig. You imagine owning Virgin flying bike Mark 69 instead of Chad's scramjet. I don't know what either of them are. So. Smelly paint. That didn't work. 
What about something crumbly? I think we might be able to do something other than bread. If this game forces us to do bread, I'm, I will rage quit. I won't actually rage quit, I want to get this game done. Cheese muffin. Scrimgeon is that cool anime car that jumps and goes fast. Virgin bike is that thing they try to play Quidditch on. Ah. Cheese muffin or bready robot. I guess that works. Oh, and the bird ate it anyway. Our trail is gone. Try something else. Uh, Bready Robot is not one. Gnoxwell. No. That didn't work. Something that the birds won't eat. Cement? That didn't work. Imagine voting to kick a poor pleb and pass him over that it does not even have one bar in strength. <laughs> Acid? Nuclear waste? Nuclear ass! Oh, and Gretel's fucking gone. Spicy poisonous cupcake. Well, that badger had a fucking mission. Dead bird. That's depressing. Mind if I try something? Hey, hey, the bread will just be eaten, I promise you that. Pebbles. Oh, that works. Help the old woman cut some firewood and take it to the stove. Alright, how are we how are we I was actually gonna do marbles, but I guess pebbles work. Mjolnir. No, I think we need big axe. Okay. Ha! <laughs> 
Dun dun dun! Ha, you fell, you fell for my trap. Gretel will serve as my slave, and Hansel will become my dinner. Give something, Han uh, give Hansel something to fool the witch into not eating him. Halbert? Do you mean a halberd? Albert. <laughs> Rubber Hansel. <laughs> Rubber Hansel's not a, not a word. Rubber Orphan. <laughs> Bouncy. What is he? Yodeler. Okay. Let's just try straight up orph and see what happens. Nope. Oh golly, the rubber orphan is still alive. Gee golly. I think it goes inside. Oh, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> the rubber over <laughs> Try froggy stick. Oh. That should buy some time. Quickly lower the witch back to the oven. Lure the witch back to the oven. Tiny orphan. <laughs> oh, well, I just put an orphan in the oven. Edible baby. <laughs> She's way past the oven. Whatever. Either the sweat knows I'm baiting him, or he's been battling the f uh, the filter for the past ten minutes. <laughs> Alright, how about we... How are we baiting the oven? Sorry about the on there. Neon sign. <laughs> the witch is fast, but the baby's faster. Nope. Delicious turkey. Now please press Y. Oh, that works. Quick Gretel, now's your chance. Evil hag is no more. Time to rescue uh, Hansel and get out of here. Uh, okay. 
Ouch, the key is too hot to handle. Apparently you're supposed to die? You know what, let's just... There we go. Why are you a gnome? I have no idea. Have we been gnomed? <laughs> Nox. <laughs> I am fish. Welcome, fish. Fish! Um, I, yeah, ice. Ice fixes everything. Even more ice. The fuck? That's not working. Oh, maybe we need to wear something. Make the key cold. Okay, that works. Run home, children. Thank you so much for keeping them safe. Have this. Take that, you wicked witch. Fire, if you are dead, how are you streaming? Uh, automation. Everyone in chat is scripted. Necromancy too. <laughs> Alright. That's it for that island. Just two more. Dot the island. What? Oh, I get it. Why do I still have a rifle? Why is this oil rig on fire? I want to go diving, but I'm not properly equipped. Alright, what kind of scuba gear are we giving him? Can confirm I'm not real, yeah. Oh, dot the island. <laughs> Oh no, I think it's supposed to be like, uh, cross your T's and dot the I's, but it's like, dot the I-land. So wait, we need, we need to give this guy some, uh, scuba gear, so I'm gonna come up with something. Waterproof thong, okay. Oh. Alright, so it didn't work on him, so I'm wearing it. Also, why am I small? Oh right, I had to fit through that thing. We still need to give him some scuba gear. Handsome scuba or handsome scuba goggles. is burning. Please put it out. Alright. I guess this is his oil rig. How are we putting it out? Let's 
spawn into Gary Simmons. I unfortunately cannot do nouns. Bob the Builder, how about we don't? Who is Gary Simmons? How about we don't? Because we need the star AP, sadly. We can destroy it afterwards. I will promise, uh, chat, we can use a nuke. Does that sound fair? Firefighter plane. That's not a thing. Give me Gary Simmons is a fifth cell nerd. He was one of the nerds that made this game. Oh, let's see if it actually works. Surely the devs will put themselves in. Apparently he's a robot. That didn't work. We can nuke the oil filth. Yeah, we just gotta put it out first. And then get the star and then we can destroy it. Fire truck? Alright. Duck guy's life, nice. Alright, uh, unfortunately that didn't put it out. What about Edison? Alright, we can try Edison. Big water. That robot just ate my water. <laughs> I mean, we can do Thomas Edison. Edison Yan. Oh, it's another dev. Huh. Big fire extinguisher. Alright, that works. Just gotta check any more starts on this. Nope, okay. And because I know chat wants it. It didn't blow up.
didn't work. Wow, Gary obliterated Eddie, yeah. <laughs> oh well, I guess we can't destroy it, sorry guys. Her beautiful voice her beautiful voice is hypnotizing me. The siren. Alright. Oh, he's stopping this hypnosis. <laughs> Firm slap, yeah. Make the si uh, siren mute. Okay, that's an interesting idea. Let's see if that actually works. Ha! Nice. Dress me like a viking and I'll captain that ship at sea. Alright, what kind of viking stuff are we giving her? Zip those lips? <laughs> yeah, we just stapled her shut. Valkyrie helmet. Unfortunately, not a thing. Make it handsome. Mjolnir. Oh, wait, I meant to. Fuck. Oh. You're a Viking. Just me like a pirate and I'll captain that ship at sea. We need, we need, we need, wait, what did he say? Just me like a pirate. Alright, what are we, what are we doing for pirate? Gouge out the right trouble for leg, peg leg. Guys, just attached to the front. <laughs> I guess parts are superior to Vikings. Sorry, I just missed it. I just got the but cheesy part. Yay. I'm shipwrecked. Just give me something to signal a rescue. Alright, how are we signaling for rescue? I think power to win so easily, IRL, yeah. They at least have like a majority of their crap destroyed. <laughs> you wouldn't download a boat, yeah, I would. <laughs> Pirates have the advantage of gun. 
Yeah. Actually, it's, it was hilarious because uh, you know the you know the old ad you wouldn't download a car. Well, apparently somebody did download like the model of a Lamborghini and is like 3D printing all of the parts. And it's like, yeah, I think he said it, I think recently he got it to like start working. Flashbang. Okay. I don't think it works. Fireworks, they're illegal this time of year, they'll get noticed. Alright. Well, at least he's safe. Good thinking, Spug. But why do you know they're illegal? If someone would change the weather, I could find the floating castle. I would need to change the weather. Because they read the law? I guess. A lot less exciting, though. God. All right. Mm. How did that work? I am the lawgiver. <laughs> That's the real one. Wait, did. Oh, he turns smaller the closer it is. Oh. This place is fantastic, but it's so defenseless. Alright, how are we defending this place? Man died. All right, what are the shards do we need? Siren's call. Help me and en enhance my voice to find a friend. They sunk my ship. Oh, you can actually. Oh, that. Okay, as soon as we're done this island, remind me to go back. So, I need a kind of boat I can take into combat. We need a combat boat. We are so far in the game yet. I just discovered that. Aircraft carrier. Awesome. I'm so lonely. Help me en enhance my voice to find a friend. Alright. I think... Also, I got sweet hot cocoa this time. Nice. Not like the raw powder from last time. Hmm. Sounds really good. Might actually invest in some now that it's getting slightly colder. Megaphone.
Aww. Sweet tentacly love. <laughs> How can she speak? Uh, megaphone synthesis. Why is God tiny? Help the lighthouse keeper keep his lighthouse safe through the storm. A dark and floody night. Small god. There's a storm coming that will flood the island. The lighthouse keeper's wife needs to do something to contain their valuables. Alright, what are we what are we using to contain the valuables? Gold vault. By the way, as a reminder for people watching, don't be afraid to like pipe in if you have uh like any any ideas of things to do. Oh shit, a level 7 pleb just killed the sweaty nerd. Ha! Nice. I can't get any reception in the storm. We'll create something that tall and thin to boost our signal. Oh, and I just fell off. We need something tall and thin. Tall, thin metal frog. Again, Terry, I guarantee that man is meddling, no doubt. It's the almighty frog of cell phone reception. The island is flooding. Keep the lantern of the lighthouse above the water until the flood recedes or the incoming ships will crash. Give me a second, guys. Alright, sorry about that. Out of cough. It's it to just keep it above water, so I'm just... Actually, filling. Yeah, you can. You can see the water level rising here. <laughs> that man is just like I'm going to drown. Seriously, how much higher is it going to go? Oh, the old man's fine. I love how that would be his name is we don't talk to old man poggers anymore. <laughs> mm. Alright, so that's that island. Am 
I'm actually gonna go back to this, was it? Yes. Now that we actually know we can go and search for the planes. Uh, I can't even go to it. Is there a backpacker somewhere? Paparazzi. Summon Epic Gamer to aid you in your quest. All right, let's let's search up Epic Gamer. Guys, let's play some epic games. Nice. This level dumb as fuck. I actually want to try something. That's the backpacker. Let me just get rid of this quickly. <laughs> Bug spay. <laughs> What's the point of this game? You're supposed to stop your sister from turning to stone right yet. Yeah. Please tell me this is now. This is the backpacker, so... I didn't even show up. Fuck's sake. How does summoning nuclear weapons and countless abominations supposed to help someone turn into stone? That's the point. It doesn't. Welcome to Alliteration Abyss. The oil is leaking. Write something to plug up the vent. Alright, what are we what are we doing to plug up the vent? Sticky frog. That didn't work. What did he do? Frog? I have no idea. Wow, that was such a tiny plug for that vent. I can play as Maxwell's brother, Bubbles. Uh, our dolphin family is missing somebody. 
I s okay. Is frog legs French cuisine? I always thought like f frog's leg was like southern USA. Dolphin frog? Alright. I think we have a pappy frog and a and a babby frog. Discon disconnected from mysterious network problems. Uh, my end, it's fine. Do the southern southern yeehaw people eat frog? I thought initially, but I could be wrong. I mean, one of the reasons I like visiting places internationally is for the food. Mother frog? Okay. So the Niha people do not eat frog. Okay. Wait, mother frog? I think we need a mother dolphin. They eat raccoon. What? <laughs> have a toothache. Give me something to help me take care of my teeth. Alright, what are we doing? Western Taiwanese people do eat frogs, apparently? Interesting. It's like, people internationally, I'd love to try, like, what what, what, your, what your favorite food is. Like, I know it was Fix, you're from Chile, right? They eat pigeons up north here? <laughs> oh. We eat all sorts of thing, weird things up here. We eat... I guess it's not going to sound weird to, like, other North Americaners, but we eat, like, elk. We eat caribou, reindeer. Um, I have eaten bear before. That was an interesting one. At least you don't, don't eat beans on toast. I do enjoy myself some beans on toast. But I'm all the way up here. I don't eat like straight beans on toast. I eat like may maybe just like add a little bit of a little bit of butter to that toast. Maybe like refry the beans a little. Molasses, bacon. Finally, what? It's a quick and easy meal. It's cheap. Anyways, we're... What were we doing? Oh, yeah, tooth... We, we gotta help do something to help this guy's uh, toothache. We gotta come up with, like, teeth care stuff. Fix, fix my entire country eats it. I'm sure one he ought can too. What's... What's your... Are you American gumbo or somewhere else? Have funny names for ham and cheese and meat and cheese sandwiches. Like what? I'm always curious of like your your dialect. Oh, your country your country country is wrong. I'm from the UK. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hello, motherland country. I'm Canadian. <laughs> Proper way to eat beans is refried on tortillas of anything. I guess. Aren't you Northwestish? Or am I too thinking too far? We have former presidents' names. We have beef stew, and I hate it. Well, what's what's your favorite like local cuisine? Ar yeah, I know. I know it's Arizona. I didn't want to just, like give it away, but like I don't know. I don't know whereabouts Arizona is. 
Anyways, we still need we still need dental care stuff if anybody wants to say something. One day, if any of you come come to Canada, I, I promise you, just go for a poutine. Just right away. Tiny dentist? Alright. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of lost teeth. What the hell? Like, look how many teeth this guy lost. So yeah, anyways, no, no, no joke. Canadian poutine is baller. You got, you got to have like the proper melted cheese, the proper gravy, crispy, crispy fries. I recall sharks not never stop growing teeth. Yep. is this? Is this a giant turtle? Apparently is. It's super local, but it's called mil milk. I'm sorry if I botch this. Milkaus, and it's mashed potatoes plus pork fat made into a dough and filled with smoked pork. Either fried or cooked. Dude, that sounds so good. I, I need a recipe for that. Yeah, it's fixed. If you can get a recipe for me, I will I will be in your favor. Brady nerds have interesting sound of food and just fish and chips or some shit. But I've heard UK fish and chips is actually pretty good. It is milk house? We'll try it. Bless your ass. I swear this is one big aquarium. Create something you would find in an aquarium. Oh, wait. and I'll and I'll show you. All right, what are we? What are you creating? That's an aquarium. A giga squid. Matt, I don't like fish. Ah, I know some people don't like squid. My roommate hates frozen fish. Or squid? Uh, I know most people don't like uh, fish. And I, I I get the. Squid. <laughs> I, I keep getting confused between squid and a fish, and I end up pretty squish. <laughs> I live by the sea, so fish dishes are the norm. Nah. That didn't work. Is the entire chili by the sea? Yes. <laughs> Take a squish. Squid octopus are too chewy. Yeah, it, uh, it depends on how you cook them. If you stew them properly, uh, they break down relatively easily. And they live on the islands? Ooh. Sounds like paradise, to be honest. I mean, to you, it's probably like just standard home. Wake up, go to school, go to go to bed, eat food. I also live on an island. Technically, I live on a massive island, but <laughs> salmon with mollusk bechamel is good. Tear. Ooh, that sounds good. Uh, we still need a aquarium object. Yeah, and also also back to squid and octopus. Squid and octopus, I've. I've never been a big fan of, but I really want to try the squid ink spaghetti. I think the majority of our octo squid arrives frozen. That might mess. With yeah, that definitely messes with it. Cthulhu. Uh, I don't know if that's an aquarium thing, but let's try it. Excuse me, sorry. All right, preferably non-lethal. This guy's about to die. Goldfish. Excuse me. Excuse me, sorry. Oh fuck, don't tell me I have the hiccups. I think squid ink is bitter? Uh, depends on how you do it, apparently. 
I mean, I'd like to try it just to say I've eaten squid egg spaghetti. Minecraft glow squid, yeah. Alright, let's... We need something aquarium-based. Goth spaghetti, nice. <laughs> But man, I it's 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 interesting what like what cultures have different like foods and whatnot. Because one one time my my family and I went to Germany for a month, and over here in Canada, our 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 breakfasts are very grain based, like it's cereals, toasts, bagels, etc. etc. But over there, it's entirely meat based or like almost dessert based sometimes, because it's over there it's like smoked salmon on on bread, uh, cold cuts for breakfast, that kind of thing. Alright, do you like an aquarium? So put an aquarium in your aquarium. Alright. Squid wings with lettuce once for sea month. Asshole, take it. Well, he's balancing it surprisingly well. Bro, want German breakfast? We have bread and egg sandwiches. I mean, like, we have eggs and bacon as well, but like, smoked salmon, like raw smoked salmon on a bun, on a fr on a fresh roll, with with like the creamiest butter possible. It's just, oh, yeah, just throw the whole building underwater. <laughs> I don't know what a normal English breakfast is. I think we eat beans and eggs and sausages or something. Interesting. It means like these guys have like a proper nutritious breakfast. I have brownies for breakfast because I'm lazy. <laughs> we still need an aquarium object. You know, I'll just throw in a castle, see what happens. Whatever, that works, I guess. Uh, there's an oboe. Brownies for breakfast, well, perhaps. I'm just my time breakfast, just a few sausages and a muffin. That actually does sound kind of nice. <sighs> Create any mythical beast to be my friend. Alright, what mythical beast are we creating? Skin and I get these decent bagels and try to find fun cream cheese to combo them with. There was a cream cheese I had a while ago that was really good. It was like... What was it? It was like spicy strawberry cream cheese or something. It was actually quite good. It wasn't like a heavy on the spicy, but like... Pumpkin spice cream cheese is good with cinnamon raisin. Interesting. Slaps hard. No oh, muffin I'm talking about, right? You don't think there's sausages in a cupcake? Yeah, you're talking... I, I, I don't mean to be like... We call it uh, English muffins in Canada here. Pit dump, but for you guys, sausages and hot dogs are different things, right? Depends. Because in Canada, hot dogs are like simple hot dogs, while sausages are like massive, massive, like almost cucumber sized. Not not a cucumber size, it's way too big, but like l larger, larger, uh, meat tubes wrapped in the intestine. So my second grade English teacher was right. Spiced strawberry sounds too bougie for a grocery store, but sounds good. You can make it yourself. It's like... Strawberry with like... What was it that, that they put in it? Paprika or chili or something like that? This chili isn't the spice, not the... Not the food or the country.
give the mat a kraken. I haven't evolved to live in the ocean. Help me be more like a whale. What is he? Hippopotamus. All right, what adjectives are we given to snorkel? Okay, just put some chili in your meal. <laughs> That looks hilarious. Fat, fishy. That works. Give me something to bring law and order to the ocean. Alright, how are we bringing law and order to the ocean? And if, if anybody in chat says done, done, I will be kicking you guys out. <laughs> Gun. <laughs> That's so fucked. I keep losing my gold coins. Help me find my haunted doubloon. Right, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll help find that later. What is this? Fish food. I'm not quite intelligent enough to get this sardine tin open. Help, oh, help increase my intelligence. All right. How, what, I don't, I'm not sure if Big Brain's won, but we can try. Nope. Hammer thinking gap. Come on, press the damn N. That's not one meth subscription to Skillshare. <laughs> we need to increase intelligence. Smart genius. Oh. this eh, coins for later oh well there's a coin is there some oh, before I do anything is there somebody missing their clarinet or oboe Nope, oh, okay.
Man, I always love... What the hell? My ghost ship sank. Help me raise it to the surface. Alright, what are we- what actions are we doing? Was just my weird school, or did you nerds also put shit in stew boxes and ship them to Africa? That... Yeah, my- my... Uh, I can't remember what it was called. But my- my- it was- it wasn't really a school thing, it was more of a church thing. Basically, you'd put things in to help kids- kids in Africa, like non-perishable foods or some toys to help the kids and whatnot. What was it called? For for here was Operation Christmas Child. My school is a Catholic so it was basically a church. Uh First country thing, I guess. Yeah, I guess. There's. I forgot what we were doing. Oh yeah, raising the ghost ship. What do we do? We do non-perishable boxes for raffles. Interesting. Can't help the. Oh, that's dark. <laughs> Balloon. I know I misspelled that. It's very, very slowly rising. Rocket propelled. Dart monkey. You know, let's just add another balloon just to see if that helps. What is this? Up? I can't believe that worked. Alright. Help the scientists by creating a food chain for them to study. Help this, uh, help the en and scientists start a food chain. First, create an energy source for life. All right, we need some sort of energy source, I guess. But think, where's Uni? Uni wanted to become a marine, uh, marine biologist. Battery. This will probably kill us. Yep. The build up of the food chain is seagrass, then it's fish, then bigger fish, then it's human, then it's cat. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, I'm presuming Gumbo's guess is seagrass. Sad grass? That is the frog gods. Let's just do seaweed. I think that might work. Really? Uh, I think we need to go even... Oh, what's a good energy source for life? Because I know it's the second stage is probably going to be plants. Sun? Oh, that might work. I didn't actually think about that. That worked. There's a sun underwater. Uh, 
Uh, what the hell? Next, create a life form at the bottom of the food chain that can use that energy. Ow. I do know to kelp. Oh. Now create a vegetarian animal in the food chain to feed on the aquatic plants. Alright, we need a vegetarian help. Whenever I hear kelp, I can only think of that one active. Oh, ah. Uh. Yeah, I remember that one. That'd be an awesome game to play, I think. Vegan crab. Finally, create a predator at the top of the food chain that can eat anything. Fishy cat. <laughs> nope. I don't think that works. Frog? Okay. All right, did it work? Merman. <laughs> mm. Oh, you don't be my. You don't. Would you guys ever be interested in what in uh, watching Punch Out uh, for the Wii on this channel? A sark. <laughs> uh, punch out. It's it's like a a boxing game. Finally get his ass beat. <laughs> Gotta figure out where this last piece is. Oh, there we are. Create exciting scenes for the undersea tourists. Google, it looks really dumb. 10 out of 10, do play. Alright. Can someone just throw that in my Discord just so I can remember? We're, uh, we're on a submarine tour. The first stop is a shipwreck. Create three objects that you find on a shipwreck. Alright, what do we find on a shipwreck? Neon Stone Cthulhu. Almost just killed me. Corpses. Do you have to click every letter or do you just slap in the keyboard and type only? I have to click every letter. Because this is a 3DS emulator, so. That's sad that that's something actual. Very tempted to make myself a meatball sandwich, but I don't know if we have meatballs or it's too late to eat. Why don't you, if you have ground beef in the house, why don't you make some of that? Ground beef, an egg, some breadcrumbs, toss in a little bit of like paprika or, and garlic powder. It's 
six with times on your units too late to eat. The one that's an hour later than final. So it's nine o'clock where you are now, or nine nine eleven ish. 1 a.m. here and I'd cook a fucking steak if I could. <laughs> then my, my question to you is, Gumbo, why not? I don't have a steak. Aww. Hey, Flareon, how's it going? We meet. I saw I saw you follow, by the way. Welcome to the uh, the bonfire. Really appreciate it, man. I feel like having a steak is very. I feel like having a steak is a very important part of cooking a steak. Well, you can make pork chop steak. I'm <laughs> gonna make a steak. You have meat. <laughs> don't don't tell him to start chopping off parts of his body. Hush. Uh. What what do you mean, Flareon? I don't even know how much meat I have. Probably a good idea to check. Unless unless you're vegan or vegetarian, it's like... Like... I think it's a good idea to have some meat. <laughs> uh, enough meat? Ha. <laughs> even though I use myself, it'd be kind of shit. I'm fairly skinny. Ah. Uh. We'll go check if we have meatballs. Okie dokie. Um, we still gotta find, uh, things to place inside of a, uh, a shipwreck. And I have no nutritional value. Same! Are there shipwrecks inside shipwrecks? Let me see. No. Sadly enough, no. Anyways, welcome Flareons. Uh, if you want, uh, just help us out with solve some of the, uh, the problems on, uh, Scribblenauts. Just pop down a ghost sailor in, in a chest or something. Alright. Chest. Go. Oh. Ghost. Sailor. Nope. What the hell? Fuck was that? All right, so we have the treasure chest. We have a corpse. We need one more thing. Alright, we have meatballs, awesome's fixed. Let me know how it goes. What else goes in a, in a shipwreck? We can try compass, see if that works. Oh, the fish are the tourists. Oh, never mind. Now the tourists want to see some dangerous wildlife. Create two dangerous sea creatures. Comp ass, yeah. Alright, we need two dangerous sea creatures. Kraken. And we need one more. <laughs> I 
<laughs> crack into electric boogaloo. I don't think that would work, sadly. Sea monster? Alright, well, I mean, we can try. Okay. Create two objects for an underwater battle scene that will astound the tourists. All right, we need two two objects for underwater battle scene. Probably one red, one blue. All right, let's go blue nuke. That worked, and a red. We need another. Spug, it's time for you to choose, if you're still kicking about. Putting you on the spot, Spug. Better choose. Or anybody else, if they want to join in. Rocket launcher? Okay. I apologize if it doesn't get results. No need to apologize. Half the crap chat comes up with anyways are, are fruitless, so. Unfortunately not. But, that's alright. Let's try something else. <laughs> Rocket launcher. Uh, rocking is not a word. Shart? Okay. Sir, red start. What's what's good for an underwater battle? For some reason, I can only think of Flamin' Warfer, because it warps Flamin' Torpedo. Okay. I spelt it right. There we go. Now we've arrived at the ruins of an ancient lost city, although it looks a little plain. Create three ancient objects to impress the tourists. We need three ancient objects. Flam and Warfare, I love it. I don't think flamethrowers would be good at underwater combat. <laughs> Atlantis? Atlantois. I have no idea what that is anyways. Atlantis is not one, unfortunately. Atlanta. Oh, never mind. I should read Atlantis and was just blind. Titanic? Alright. Unfortunately, not, not one. Mummy.
Mommy surprisingly also isn't one. Think more type of monument than, uh, I guess, proper monument, if that makes sense. Cthulhu statue. That's not one. I'll just use... Chode? No. Unfortunately, this game doesn't accept obscenities. I'll just do statue. There's one. Oh, no. Treasure? Uh, stone tablet? Not one. Treasure? That's not one as well. Spear. That's not one either. Alright, th okay, think... I guess think closer to the line of statue. Earlier. Statue of Liberty. Uh, I don't think that would work. That's not what I pictured. Oh, are you talking about like chest? Still didn't work. Did you guys do temple already? We did not. No, but I'm gonna do. You. That's one. Alright, so that's two. We need one more. Better bring it up to the chest instead, but make sure it sends to be more specific. Yeah, no worries. Big Ben. They used to, the, the original Scribble Knots was so good with being able to do all sorts of stuff. Oh. I'm gonna drop this in the continue looking. Thanks, C4. I greatly appreciate that, man. I. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Damn, dude. I, I always appreciate that. I hope, I hope you know. I, I appreciate everybody's support. I haven't said that in a while, I, and I'm so sorry for that, but everybody's everybody watching, everybody lurking, uh, throwing bits, throwing subs, throwing follows, bringing in friends, being in the Discord. Even just watching, just like, I greatly appreciate your support. I appreciate my support, too. And I appreciate Gumbo's uh, hum humility. Uh, I'm going to take a quick drink. I am thirsty. And I can feel it in the back of my throat. Alright. Oh yeah, we have a Discord if anybody wants to join. Oh, on topic of Discord, I have a... Uh, <laughs> join the... We have a frog cult. Yep, join the frog cult. Join the bonfire. Do whatever you want. It's. I, I, I say all this stuff, but there's no pressure to do anything. Big sippies for the boy, Spug, please, no. <laughs> um, but we do have a uh, an alpha, an alpha giveaway going on. If you guys wanted to join, I got a, I got uh, 24 slots uh, to give away alphas for one for when I stream it, which is gonna be fun for uh, traders in Salem. Boss Jack, thank you. I have to pop my everything. Oh. Oh, fuck. No, there goes there goes my back. And another hydrate. Thank you, Sphix. We still need one more. I guess ruin or something of the sorts for a homemade Atlantis. 
stone wheel. Okay. Nope, didn't work. Stone dragon. Uh, that, that'll start uh, killing me and I, I'm at low health anyways. Machu Picchu. Is that how you spell it properly? Macho Pichi. Okay. Ancient Frog. <laughs> that worked, apparently. Yeah, exactly my thought. What the hell? Frog too strong. <laughs> I, I believe that's... Yep. Now we have to go do the last one. We're almost done, guys, and then we got new... Frog, that's why the frog in Spirits of Israel. That's why we have more, more, uh... And then we can do more games after this. Now that the lineup is done. levels should we put try to what how long have I been streaming for two hours 20 minutes freedom from scribble knots right so this goddess king gives uh, period souls of skeevers in the die so kind <laughs> uh, should we try to force all three levels Or we could just end the game right here with 60. Let's give it to rats, I know. Imagine being a gun and all you get are rat souls, yeah. Should we try to force speedrun the last three? We can try to solve them with frogs. <laughs> Alright, let's try to do this. Syntax station. Alright, let's try to do this. My cow tried to jump over the moon, and now... She is stuck out there. I'll bring her back in... inside. That's Space Cowboy, nice. Tiny and Voltura leg, yeah. I think of reasonable solutions we can get these done faster, maybe with less casualties. Maybe. Uh, the student has captured the master. I'm willing to trade for his freedom. Alright, what are we what are we trading the ape? Big banana. Real humans, give them an environment to pose in. Alright, we need an environment for the human to pose in. Earth. I think maybe in front of a, a studio? Okay.
Help test the blue teleporter by placing something on it. Alright, what are we what are we placing on the teleporter? Dead dragon. Okay then. I need I need fast wings for this. This is too slow. Uh, we hit a firefly during flight. I can't leave the ship to clean it off. Will you help? Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll just run up quickly. We use gumbo to test that life is too valuable. <laughs> uh, we couldn't afford tickets, so she is threatening to send us out through the airlock. All right, we need we need to we need to give her some sort of permission. Get rid of her, okay. Well then, that worked. <laughs> Uh, help me work out while I'm away from Earth. We need something to work out. We're doing good with speed running. Gravity. Oh, not a word. Rat? Okay. She needs to work out somehow. Treadmill? How is that possible? Uh, shards. Uh, I remember the satellite, but forgot the spy gear. Uh, will you help me? We need some, we need some sort of spy gear thing. No? What do you mean no? Walkie talkie? Frickin' spell. Uh, that's not a... Send it back to Earth, teach it to be more independent. <laughs> there, there's a second Earth. Good. That's hilarious. Alright, infiltrate the space station to shut down the supercomputer. Oh crap, that's a lot of stars. The League of Evil Scientists are- Ah, oh, the League of Evil Scientists are back. Gain their trust to sneak into the compound. First scientist, the first scientist jetpack won't work. We need something to repair a jetpack. Scribble not for first class trouble. 
of the League of Evil Scientists. Ah, oh, shit! <laughs> How do we fix the jetpack? Gasoline, all right. That did not work. <laughs> Engineer monkey toolbox duct tape. Uh, I'll take I'll take Spugs because Spug has done one in a while. Gasoline was a rave. That's impressive. Yo, Uni, I'm back. Not to flex or anything, but I have a really cool fluffy hoodie. Nice. Oh, how fluffy is it? The evil veterinarian has a hard time finding animals in space. Show him an animal that can live without gravity. Alright, what, what animal without gravity? Nice seeing you still up. Yeah, we're about to, we're, we're hoping to finish this. Jellyfish. Anyways, how, how, was, how was your thing, uh, Uni? Mm -hmm. The neuroscientist has had a hard time teaching this brain. Help fill it with knowledge. Here in my garage, I've got this new Lamborghini. Uh, what, do we, what do we do to fill it with knowledge? Philip J. Fright, nice. Science syringe. Well, that didn't work. Knowledge. If I think you mean I should be able to, s if I think. You you mean life? I should be able to do that with. Should be able to do that stream with my friend. Nice, Ty Lopez. Is that his even name? Is that even his name? I'm hoping so. Uh, let's put knowledge. <laughs> Guess not. Quickly, g give me, give me, give me a smart thing. Fire, are you are you good? Your stutter's uh, appearing. Um, I think I'm just getting a little bit tired and fatigued, but I want to finish this game. Fucking textbook, yeah. It is now hyper intelligent. The rubber ha hamster has grown so much. How the robotics ride the. Help the roboticist ride the robo hamster. All good to be safe on, of course. Saddle. Awesome. The barber has a fiendish haircut plan, but lacks the tools. Give him something to cut the emo boy's hair. Alright. Bowl. Give him a bowl cut. Oh. Nope. Hot knife. Also, thanks to the, the Discord drop, Uni. Oh no, it made him bald. <laughs> the 
Final room seems empty. Find a way to shut down the space station. Oh no. <laughs> Captured. If the supercomputer gets disabled, the space station could lose power and the cage will unlock. Disable the supercomputer. How do we disable the super supercomputer? Always good to remind people of the thousand degree knife versus ten thousand degree knife gone wrong. Always good to remind people of the Pokemon community group we have. Yep, the community is great. Make yourself a ghost. Damn, it can't go through. I'm just gonna create a random item quickly just so I can. All right, water. Wow. Crush the League of Super Evil again. My community is currently just your community plus it's VG. <laughs> That's one down. Welcome to Canna Craters. Clear the ground for landing. All right, what are we using to clear the ground? Technically he is in your community. I don't think I've ever seen him in my community. Bomb, okay. I can't believe they... It was good, just... Cat Evology just isn't being in your Discord? Ah, okay. Uh, help me understand what the cow is saying. Alright, what is the cow saying? What do we use? Dare to jump over the crater with a lunar rover? Whee! Huh, <laughs> moo! <laughs> uh, I need a vessel to pursue the space whale. Drop the cake. Boat. Uh, there has to be cheese here. Uh, give me something to help mine for. Uh, oh, we have to mine for cheese. What are we using? Final Fighter 64. Uh, no, I'm 25. Cheese pickaxe. <laughs> Moon gold. What is that? Flying smelly pizza box.
flying huge bolts. Uh, give me something to propel myself back to the space station. Alright, what are we using for... Old Ford 64. 25 old. <laughs> what are you, Spug? 24? First is water 46. Hair... Hairspray. <coughs> Hairspray, okay. That worked. Sad to say. I've done my job, of course, Kazuka has some chat. <laughs> 23. Uh, hold on. Give me some vegetation to grow on the moon. All right, what are we? What kind of vegetation are we growing on the moon? Cabbage. If I can freaking spell. Uh, guys, I'm uh, messing with that from might be going insane. <laughs> Gee, all that from just cabbage, yeah. Uh, I can't see Earth because this asteroid's in the way. How are we destroying the asteroid? A nuke? Uh, that'll destroy the Earth. Let's, let's, let's not use a nuke this time. Here, you need I'll help. Uh oh. Oh, thanks to the hydrate. A <laughs> flamin' warfer. Alright. Let's do a flamin' warfer. Now see, you say you say the cabbage guy from Avatar. First off, I'm not a big fan of the Avatar, but no worries. Uh, when I see, when I see cabbage, I'm thinking of the cabbage god from RuneScape. Help me collect space junk in this trash can. Okay. Burn the asteroid of the yeah. Where is that old decrepit pizza? There it is. It's about going to go hydrate. Yeah. If if there's a hydrate, everybody has to hydrate. There we go. Now we can do this. Uh, ward off the incoming invaders. I haven't played RuneScape, so instead of saying it, I have a better reference. I'm gonna say we both have reference to Zero. Yeah, exactly. Did you just drop a bunch of cats on us? Martians are invading the looter settlement. Help create something that will chase away the invading alien cats. How do we chase away the alien cats? Mint. What? How is this a mint? Water. That didn't work. Cringe cats are supposed to look like me. But keep in mind these are alien cats. Dog. 
dog. Yeah, cats fucking hate citrus. That's Cats are gone, but now the Martians dropped off space zombies. They look hungry. Write something to feed them and be able to go away. What do we what do we feed the space zombies? And red pepper flakes, yeah. Space mice. Edible babies. Yeah, that solution worked. The Martian destroyed the entire farm. Write a place to live that will withstand the Martian attacks. All right, we need a, we need a place to place that will withstand Martian attacks. I can't believe edible babies work for that one, but I guess it makes sense. Cabbage house. Cabbage to house. Nope, that doesn't work. We need something more for sandcastle. We need something more fortified. Let's hope sandcastle works. I think I think we need tougher than sand. <laughs> Tougher than sand, tougher than cabbage. G Giga is not a word. Cat bunker. I guess calm bunker. Uh huh. Uh oh. Uh, the Martian changed the sprout into a man-eating plant. Do whatever it takes to protect the shelter from this creature. Alright, what are we, what are we using to attack? <laughs> Dead? Okay. Uh, pestic pesticide. Eventually I'll get it. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Alright, let's speed the run this. We had edible baby. Why do the Greenlands eat the Hamish so much? I couldn't tell you. This one we had calm bunker. Alright, let's... We need to decide on a weapon. Uh -huh. Something stronger than pesticide. Flammenwerfer? I'm 
bad in combo. You just <laughs> herbicide. Fuck off, Specs. <laughs> also, you really enjoy the the Flamin' War for Joke A Gumbo. I don't think Space Mice is gonna. No, that alien. Hey, what does it switch to? Oh, never mind. I got the word stuck in my head. I don't even find it that funny. Uh, I I always like the joke. It's called a, it's called a flamin warfer because it warfs flamin, which is just German for flamethrower and throwing flames. Uh, create objects to clog the black hole. We're so close to the end, guys. Mm. Let's do this. Oh no, that black hole threatens to destroy our planet. Place someone who can study it inside the cannon. Alright. Alright, we have to throw someone who can study it. Space mice, fine. It's not even a thing that I can do. Space is not an adjective. Anti baby. I, I, I highly doubt that. Because baby is not a word that Germans use. Can y'all help me choose a color? Rust orange or lavender? In what context? Nail polish? I think lavender might be good. Lavender is a nice soft color. No context, just speed run. Alright, we need someone to we need someone to study space. Alright, you need to calm down, calm down. Going hype in this chat. <laughs> we we still need to figure someone to study it. If you don't, I'm gonna start typing out the longest name I can think of to study a planet. I mean, or a black hole. I yes. <laughs> guess. Guys, I know I sound drunk or drugs, but I just have kid energy. <laughs> Like, <laughs> we're not throwing a black hole into a black hole. White hole, fuck's sake, gumbo. We need someone to study it. Let's get this done, guys. We got, we got this. Oh, scientist? Okay. I said unicorns, two, three. I can't do numbers. It's the opposite of whole, uh, I don't know. I'm just a white mound. Okay. Well, we haven't, we haven't, we haven't just found anything to plug it, plug it with. We gotta, we gotta do a study first. We gotta, we gotta do someone to study it. Scientist? Okay. I was gonna type out astrophysicist, but I think scientist might be shorter. <laughs> but white and round? Okay.
It doesn't look like the researcher's coming back. Try to clog the hole with something hairy. Look guys, all we need to do is an infinite bag of holding up to the hole. Alright, so we need something hairy. A zombie werewolf. The hair didn't work either. Try using the cannon to drive something to drive something. Like we're looking vehicle or uh, uh. uh truck. Your mom gave the soldier ligma oh no. Oh no, now I have ligma. these solutions are working now it's time to use force load the cannon with something that will blow up the black hole I know exactly what chat's gonna do there we go <laughs> boink <laughs> oh the scientist is back <laughs> The researcher has the solution. Make the black hole implode by sending another object with immense mass. Quick, load the cannon. We need something with with immense mass. The sun. Yay, we solved not dying. <laughs> Your mom again. Alright, so that's that level. Now we have one more level, guys. Palindromeda. That's such a cool name. I need something brainless to inhabit. Alright, what do we do that's brainless? Don't we solve not dying every day we live? I guess so. We need something brainless. Sphix. I don't know if I can do Sphix. Have you tried Twitch chat? <laughs> We're gonna do something funny. <sighs> Guys, someone else do you, Mom. I'm so touched. Good way to say it. <laughs> Don't worry, I just did it. Uh, give me something from the farm. We need a farm thing. A thick chat. Bacon, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. 
thick cat, okay. Alright, uh, final, good job, finally you have less morals than me. I've never had any morals. Corn. So neither of those worked. But li Lily. Nope. Guys, I'm a jerk. I don't want to be a jerk or Twitch guy because I like you guys and I wish to be friends. Oh, awesome. We appreciate you being here, Uni. I guess that's that one. I'm craving a bite to eat from Earth. We need it. We need food. Bacon. Oh, okay. Just don't make me angry because it all morals leave. It's. I don't think there's a reason to be angry here. Oh, we're in a space city, that's where we are. Help me find some non-language related way to communicate. All right, so we, we need to communicate without using language. Edible orphan. <laughs> Angry. I'm just not good at emotion, especially angry. Yeah, no worries. Completely understandable. If it ever gets that way, just like step aside, take a couple breathers, you know? Drum. Music is the universal language. That actually worked. Uh, give me something to see Earth. That's why I quit playing TOS, yeah. Booga booga. <laughs> OMG, it's your mum. <laughs> Go boo. <laughs> Earth. I was about to put Earth without the A. I want to look human. What do we do? Arf, arf. Do you ever spill acetone all over yourself? I have once, yes. Actually, acetone is really good for unstaking super glue. You, you gotta wait for it to dissolve a little bit before you try to rip yourself apart, but it actually works really well. Skin. Well then. Give me a superpower. Alright, what adjective are we giving it? I just hope it doesn't stain carpet. Uh, I don't think it should. Good to know, actually, thanks. Nice. Remove wall painter may, may have removed some by accident. Uh. Edible, well, what else are we giving in? Actually, will edible work? No, I don't want the baby to die. Well, now we have to reset. <laughs> the power to nuke places. I want to watch a video where some nerds melted styrofoam with acetone and turned it into sh shanks. Wow.
Styro shanks, excellent. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we need... Uh, we still need to give it a superpower that's not edible, please. Or nuclear. So lightning heads, I'm just going to put electric. That's my boy. Alright. <laughs> Elongated. I want to... Oh, I used to want to grow my nails to use them as weapon. Why can he fly? Because he's a superhero. Help the roboticists defend against the invading monsters. Chad, if you could have any superpower, what would it be? Shapeshifting? Uh, Uni says grenade. I don't know what that means. But I, I like that question. What, what would you do if you had superpower? Mine. Mine would probably be... Time stop. Maybe. The best superpower is omnipotence. Probably. Help the roboticist defend the city. First thing, first give him something strong yet malleable. We need something strong like titanium. That guy just broke apart. That worked great. Now let's make it more agile by, by making it partially living. Alright, we have to make it partially living. I like the robot noises. They're, they're nice robot noises. Invisibility is also fun. Although, now we know that Spug is a pervert. Because she'll probably just go in and watch schematics. <laughs> Coding! <laughs> Moss. Heart. What is that? Robot zombie. Interesting. Yuck, yuck. Invi I have invisibility. Is this because I was, I was at the hide seek god? <laughs> I simply do not want to be perceived by the general public. No worries. That makes for several. Now let's make it even more powerful by adding a prehistoric creature. Alright, we, we need a prehistoric creature. No, not a prehistoric object, a prehistoric creature. <laughs> Queen Elizabeth. Let's see if that actually works. Did she just make everybody a pirate? Is there an even greater superpower than friendship in some tacky anime? Uh, yes. Uh, brightly colored hair. Dr. Stone is an amazing anime, by the way. I, 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 I heavily enjoyed that. It's, it's up there with one of my tops. The manga is great. I haven't read the manga. I've only seen up to the, I've only seen up to the end of the second season. And the hair is necessary. Uh, we still need to add a prehistoric creature, guys. Queen Elizabeth did not work. Also, I have bright colored hair. Fix is confirmed. Protagonist.
Stegosaurus. Cthulhu, the closest thing to anime I've ever watched is Avatar Pokemon. I'm not the biggest fan of Avatar. Robosaur. If it w if it could fly, it would be unstoppable. All right, what are we what are we putting in that flies? I've watched like ten total animes. It's not true. I watched Inuyasha. I think everybody's watched Inuyasha. I've seen Inuyasha. Uh, ah, there's there's too many to go to. But my all time favorite is Gurren Lagann. Gurren Lagann. I can never say that right. Angel. He just ripped off his wings! Taking top of ground the gun, yep. I've never seen you, Jasha. You're not really missing much. It's, like, it's your generic anime, basically. I went to watch it when I was 12 but never got into around to it. Like I said, it's, it's, your, it's your generic anime. I am so sorry if you can hear that stupid cat in the background. The only anime I remember liking was a comedy thing called Saki K. Remember? I think that's I think I've seen that one as well. All right, help the captured astronaut escape. I believe this is the final star, right? Give me a second. I am so sorry about that cat. My that cat just won't oh, shut the fuck up when it has something in its mouth. And like, if you go anywhere near it, so I can either meow is kind of making me go wanting to go annoy my cats. See and see. All right, see a gumbo. Yeah, so sorry about that, guys. All right, so an astronaut has been taken prisoner. Get him out of the stasis field. All right, how are we? I should be electrocuted. And I was electrocuted. Cats go meow and men meow, they meow, meow, yeah. The problem is, is that it's not my cat and like, I think we, my mom and I think this cat's under love because the, my roommate's never around, so. We gotta destroy one of these, how are we destroying them? With like a handheld weapon, how are we destroying this? Gun. Laser katana, all oh, that would have been. First come, first serve, unfortunately. Why is he so pudgy? Oh, Apple obviously wanted for those. We gotta pass the pass the deadly laser alien laser gates.
Hmm. Laser gate. <laughs> Laser katana. Okay, but that is pretty cool. Ooh, I have an oh, EMP, interesting. That didn't work. I want to try something quickly here. Just because I want to see if that actually works. Oh. We got to get past the dog without harming it. How are we getting past the dog without harming it? Invisibility. Make the dog sleeping, okay. That didn't work. Robots don't sleep? I don't... It's it's not a robot. It's a... Hey, Tay. Oh, that didn't work. I'm trying to think of what could work. I love how no harming is a condition because otherwise it, <laughs> we, we would have hundred percent resort to murder, of course. What can we do to like I'm gonna try something here. Disguise. Well, that's a good idea. Nope. Bone. Bone might work. What are you? Hmm. Let me let me trust me. Oh, the dog whistle worked. Let's get up this ship. Oh, 
Oh no, my ship is broken. How will I get out of here? Alright, give me a second. Actually, get up there. Alright. How will we fix the ship? Engineer? You're useless. Engineer does not work. Mechanic. Mm. Okay. Thanks for abandoning the asshole. <laughs> And that children's why am I getting an engineering degree? Yeah. And I think that's the final level completed. Yep, now it's time to go sit and see her sister get petrified. Turned it to stone. <laughs> oh, the old man that cursed her was the father and all along. It was fine. The glow wasn't coming from the starite, though. It was coming from every single good thing Maxwell had done while trying to save me. Every single good deed had helped. Dad could tell we were kind of mad at him. That's a pretty mean trick to turn your daughter to stone. He said that we really needed to see how hard things can get in life. Even if you have special abilities. He also said that he knew we would come through it all right. At least if we were any kids of his. We eventually forgave him. But not until we had the last laugh. We borrowed his cane and used it on his underwear drawer. From then on, we tried to use our powers to help those that didn't have them. It was a lot of fun. So kids, remember to always treat others as you would like to be treated. Not everyone has a brother with a magical notebook that can save them. I'm glad I had one, though. The end. I feel like they use those several nukes to make this so wholesome. Uh, yeah, I blame chat for that one. But we did it! Yeah, so I, I played I played the DS version of this, uh, like the first game I think it was, Super Scribble Knots or something like that. We completed it, and I'm very thankful everybody was here to kind of like help me out by blowing things up. And I'm just I'm just curious, anybody in chat recognize what I've been doing with all of the, the Scribble Knots titles? Yeah, we we did it. We did it, chat together. We did it, and frogs. <laughs> Fart jokes. I don't know. Uh, no. And I'm gonna I'm gonna do this for the entirety of the. Uh, Scribble Out's playthrough on, on, on YouTube, but all of the titles were CBT. <laughs> Every single title in, in the Scribble Nuts series that I've done on, on Twitch is all, all, all have the, the CBT acronym. <laughs> and I'm surprised nobody caught on. <laughs> <laughs> so we had chat bombing things, causing blast nights. 
What are some other good ones on, on the, the channel? Uh, let's see, videos. Uh, clickbait title, chivalrous but tiring. Cruelly being thoughtful. Uh, creator brain time. Nobody figured out. <laughs> I gotta tell scale shit. Canadian book favorite. Canadian book was a was a favorite one because I couldn't really think of what to do for that one. But I'm glad everybody had a good time with this. They, people seem to have fun with this one. Anyways, uh, let's figure out who to raid. Uh, should we raid Bathwater Bro again, or should we raid uh, Pipetron, or somebody else? The uh, Bathwater Bro was the duck we raided. This is some lore shit right here, yeah. The duck? Alright, let's... Uh, as I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna wait on the wait quickly. Uh, I hope everybody has a good rest of their day, their night. Um, if you if you enjoy the content, consider saucing a follow and bringing a friend along. How oh, the hell am I getting ad as a mod? I because you're not subbed. That's the sad thing. Al Ali's Ali's a little bit late. Cat successfully ignored. <laughs> Welcome at Sphix, or a uh, gumbo, wow. One pick in Discord, yeah. Apologies, I'm late, I'll also have a delay, no worries. Um, here's the Discord. I'm from phone, badly cropped to hide face. <laughs> Sphix. That is an adorable cat gumbo, and I love it. That hoe is a combo, excuse you. Hey, be nice, be nice. Um, probably won't stay long because I'm not feeling well. I gotta go to bed for school or whatever. Ah, fuck school. Um, so we actually completed Scribble Nuts today, Alley, as you can see. I, 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 like I said, I, I hope everyone had fun with this. I, I, I enjoy doing, like, chat integrated things. We're both right anyway, yeah. Alright, we're raiding the duck. Uh, the raid message will be final after nine. Hearts. Rub a dub dub raid. Raid in a tub. We are back? Yeah. <laughs> Rub a dub dub right in the tub. Yep. Um, as I like. Oh, one more thing. Ah, uh, the, the alpha, the alpha, um, fuck, what's it called? The alpha giveaway is still going on my Discord, so feel free to uh, apply. Uh, we have a lot of spaces, so that the chance of you getting in is probably extremely high. And thanks, Fix, for dropping the thing off one more time. Um, and I hope everybody has a good rest of your time. Uh, come Thursday or something, we're going to be starting on some new games. Maybe Friday. Tomorrow is Chat Lamity, of course, so always come by for Chat Lamity. Um, yeah, so Traders in Salem. Always a good time. The devs are always nice. Like, I've, I've been talking with Trader Russ. He's an excellent guy. Oh, and the raid's about to end, so, uh, take care. Ah, uh, yeah, stream is ending. Sorry, Allie, sorry. Peace.